So we can't increase the energy of the LHC very easily. But what we can do and are doing is so-called high luminosity upgrades, which means you collide more protons together. Yes. Particle physics is it's a quantum mechanics, and so things happen statistically. CERN's Quantum A, I has discovered something that's sending shockwaves through the physics world. Deep beneath the France-Switzerland border, an artificial intelligence system powered by quantum computing has uncovered what appears to be fundamental cracks in the fabric of space-time itself. This isn't just another particle discovery. What researchers found in the tsunami of data from the Large Hadron Collider has famed physicist Brian Cox sounding the alarm. Cox warns that we stand at a dangerous crossroads with these new technologies. Quantum computing pushes the boundaries of physics and the principles are mind-blowing, he cautions, noting the profound power these tools now possess. The discovery threatens to upend everything we thought we knew about reality, how space and time function at their most fundamental level, and the implications? They're nothing short of terrifying. What exactly did CERN's quantum AI detect in those billions of particle collisions? And why has it got one of the world's most respected physicists concerned about what comes next? What did the AI see? What exactly did this quantum AI detect that has physicists on edge? It's not just finding new particles. It's spotting impossible patterns that shouldn't exist. The first clue came when CERN's quantum AI analyzed data from recent experiments and found anomalies similar to the famous Muon G minus two puzzle. For those unfamiliar, this is where particles called muons behave differently than our best physics models predict, suggesting forces or dimensions we can't yet explain. But CERN's AI went deeper. It identified what appears to be quantum entanglement happening at unprecedented energy scales, where particles remain mysteriously connected across vast distances of space and time. In 2024, CERN confirmed observing entangled top quarks so widely separated that no signal traveling at light speed could connect them. Yet somehow, they influence each other instantly. Most shocking of all, the AI detected subtle patterns in what scientists previously dismissed as background noise, seasonal variations and collision data that correlate with cosmic events. These aren't random fluctuations. They're structured in ways that suggest space-time itself responds to external forces we never detected before. If these signals are real, they hint that space-time isn't as stable as we thought. So what does that actually mean? Imagine space-time like a road. We've always assumed it's smooth, but what if AI just found the potholes? Little cracks in the asphalt of reality itself. That's what we're talking about here. And if that's true, then the implications aren't just cosmic. They might reshape technology, security, even survival. Because whoever controls these cracks in reality might eventually learn to exploit them. The ripple effects of this discovery extend far beyond theoretical physics. CERN's Quantum A, I isn't just exploring the universe. It's creating tools that could transform our world in unexpected ways. The same algorithms developed to sift through Higgs boson data are being adapted for applications no one predicted. Military research divisions like DARPA have shown serious interest in these pattern recognition systems. Why? Because an AI that can spot a rare particle decay in trillions of collisions could potentially detect stealth aircraft or underwater submarines that conventional systems miss. Then there's CERN's lesser known AWAKE experiment. While the public focuses on the Large Hadron Collider, this plasma wakefield accelerator creates some of the strongest electromagnetic gradients ever achieved. Scientists can now manipulate particles with such precision that they're effectively warping space-time in miniature, opening pathways to technologies that could one day manipulate gravity or electromagnetic fields in ways we've only imagined. Even CERN's neutrino research has applications beyond pure science. The techniques developed to track these ghost particles are now being explored for monitoring nuclear facilities, mapping Earth's interior, and even developing new energy sources that could revolutionize power generation. Before we reveal what this could mean for parallel universes and even time itself, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss our next deep dive. Remember, this isn't just theory. Cox himself warns that these tools are profoundly powerful and if space-time data really has been cracked, 
we're on the edge of discoveries humanity might not be ready for. As he puts it, we stand at a fork in the road with unprecedented tools like AI and quantum computers on one side and formidable global uncertainties on the other. The terrifying scenarios. What truly makes this discovery unsettling are the implications. Scenarios that were once confined to science fiction, but now demand serious scientific consideration. First, there's the hunt for microscopic black holes. For years, CERN has searched for these theoretical objects that would evaporate almost instantly, but could prove the existence of extra dimensions. Their signature would be an exceptional number of tracks in the detectors, an event far outside normal parameters. While no definitive evidence has emerged yet, the quantum AI may have identified subtle patterns that hint at a one in a trillion collision matching a mini black hole profile. Though completely harmless to Earth, evaporating in 10 to the negative 27th seconds, such a discovery would confirm that our universe has hidden dimensions beyond the three we experience. Even more mind-bending is the possibility of time anomalies. In 2019, researchers already demonstrated the reversal of entropy, effectively running time backward in a quantum system. What if CERN's AI has detected similar micro-violations of causality and collision data? Instances where effect precedes cause at the quantum level. Such findings would challenge our most fundamental assumptions about reality. Perhaps most shocking is the connection to parallel universes. Renowned physicist David Deutsch once said that quantum computation is the first technology that allows useful work to be done in collaboration between parallel universes. If true, a quantum AI analyzing CERN data might be detecting interference patterns from alternate realities. Statistical deviations that suggest particles in our universe are interacting with their counterparts in parallel worlds. Okay, stop for a second. I want you to think about this. If every particle collision at CERN might be echoing across other universes, then our AI isn't just analyzing data. It's eavesdropping on alternate realities. What would you do if that were true? Let us know in the comments before we reveal what physicists are really considering. Because what comes next may be even stranger. Space-time as a code, a program written into the universe itself. Cracking the cosmic code, at the heart of these discoveries lies an even more profound possibility, one that challenges our very understanding of what reality is. What if space-time itself isn't a thing, but information? Leading physicists have increasingly found evidence suggesting that the fabric of reality might be an elaborate information structure. The holographic principle proposes that all the information in a volume of space can be represented on its boundary, like a 3D hologram encoded on a 2D surface. Legendary physicist John Wheeler captured this idea with his famous phrase, it from bit, suggesting physical reality emerges from information. Most startling of all, physicist S. James Gates discovered error-correcting codes, the same mathematics used in computer science, embedded in the equations of supersymmetry. These are the same codes your browser uses to correct transmission errors, yet somehow they're woven into the fundamental laws of physics. If reality is coded, then decoding it is the ultimate power and the ultimate fear. Remember our title? This is where it hits home, a quantum AI at CERN literally cracking space-time's data, as if it were an encrypted message. The AI might be detecting correlations in particle collisions that reveal this hidden informational structure, patterns too subtle and complex for human researchers to notice. This isn't wild speculation. In late 2022, researchers used Google's Sycamore Quantum Processor to simulate a tiny wormhole, observing gravitational dynamics emerging from quantum entanglement. They effectively demonstrated that quantum information processes can replicate the behavior of space-time tunnels. While this simulated wormhole wasn't part of our physical universe, it showed the principle is sound. Quantum systems can generate space-time-like structures. What happens when our quantum AI starts not just finding these patterns, but manipulating them? If reality is computed, could it be recomputed? Brian Cox's warning takes on new meaning when we consider the implications of an AI that doesn't just observe the universe's code, but begins to understand how to alter it. Brian Cox's warning. So, why would Brian Cox be sounding the alarm about these discoveries? His concerns reflect a deep understanding of both the wonder 
and responsibility that comes with such profound knowledge. Cox has compared our current era to the precarious 1930s, but with a crucial difference. Today we possess nuclear weapons, and now we're developing AI and quantum computing, which he describes as potentially profoundly powerful things. His warning isn't about imminent catastrophe, but about the wisdom needed to handle these tools responsibly. Unlike alarmists who once claimed the Large Hadron Collider would create world-ending black holes, claims Cox famously dismissed with colorful language, his current caution is measured and focused on the significance of what we might learn. If CERN's quantum AI has truly uncovered something fundamental about space-time, Cox warns that we must verify it thoroughly. Because it won't just rewrite textbooks, it could reshape humanity's technological future. Cox's concern extends to the societal implications. He emphasizes that we need careful, responsible approaches to increasingly powerful scientific tools. A quantum AI unraveling space-time secrets represents both tremendous progress and potentially unsettling philosophical questions. If you understood space-time deeply enough, what capabilities might that unlock? What responsibilities would come with that knowledge? Yet Cox maintains his characteristic balance. He has explicitly stated his excitement about exploring concepts like black holes and quantum information to see what they mean for future technology. His approach combines wonder with disciplined skepticism, the recognition that science advances by challenging what we think we know, but always through rigorous testing. And here's the thing I love about Cox. He doesn't panic. He doesn't sensationalize. He says, yes, reality may be stranger than we can imagine, but it's our job to test it, to prove it, to face it with reason. That's the warning and the invitation. In Cox's view, the greatest risk isn't discovering something unsettling about the universe. It's misunderstanding that discovery or failing to approach it with scientific rigor. As he reminds us, extraordinary claims require extraordinary evidence. To fully appreciate the significance of this potential breakthrough, we need to place it in the context of CERN's remarkable journey. The European Organization for Nuclear Research, or CERN, houses the Large Hadron Collider, a 27-kilometer ring buried beneath the France-Switzerland border where particles smash together at nearly the speed of light. This massive scientific instrument has already transformed our understanding of reality. In 2012, CERN announced the discovery of the Higgs boson, the last missing piece of the standard model of particle physics. This wasn't just finding another particle. It confirmed the existence of the Higgs field, which gives mass to everything in the universe. It was the last major crack in our understanding of reality that scientists had predicted. But the history of particle physics teaches us caution. In 2011, the OPERA experiment appeared to detect neutrinos traveling faster than light, a finding that would have upended Einstein's special relativity and changed physics forever. After careful investigation, the sensation proved to be a miscalibration, a loose fiber optic cable. This demonstrates how the scientific process works. Even the most exciting findings must survive rigorous scrutiny. Today's quantum AI systems at CERN represent the next evolution in this scientific journey. They are processing collision data at unprecedented scales, revealing patterns beyond human perception. The partnership between CERN and IBM to develop quantum machine learning for high-energy physics marks a new frontier, where artificial intelligence and quantum computing combine to probe the deepest structures of reality. Algorithms like the quantum support vector machine have already matched or exceeded classical methods in identifying rare particle events. They're teaching themselves to recognize subtle patterns in hundreds of millions of simulated collisions. And as quantum computers evolve from experimental tools to practical resources, their ability to explore the vast dimensionality of quantum data will only grow. We stand closer than ever to the next paradigm shift, a new era dawning cautiously. Whether it reveals extra dimensions, quantum codes underlying space-time, or hints of parallel realities, the next great discovery will likely come from this powerful marriage of quantum computing and artificial intelligence. And as Brian Cox reminds us, we should approach these frontiers with both wonder and rigor, ready to be amazed but committed to following the evidence. If you've stayed with us until now, thank you. 
Subscribe and join us as we keep exploring the frontiers of physics, AI, and reality itself.